chapter 2, Mishnah 9. This Mishnah deals with shechita that appears to be for the purposes of idolatry. We may not slaughter into seas or rivers, i.e. in such a way that the blood falls into the water, because it looks as though one is offering a sacrifice to the angel of the sea or river. And we may not slaughter into vessels, because it looks as though one is collecting the blood in the vessel so that he could sprinkle it on an idol's altar. But one may slaughter into a pool of water, because blood mixed with water is not fit for ritual sprinkling. And if one is on a boat, one may slaughter on the top of upside-down vessels so that the blood drains off the side of the vessel into the sea. Since he is causing the blood to fall into the sea only indirectly, people will not suspect him of worshipping the angel of the sea. Rather, they will realize that he is doing this to avoid getting blood on his boat. The Torah prohibits us from imitating the behavior of idol worshippers. As it says, you shall not follow the practices of the Canaanites. Vayikra, chapter 18, verse 3. It was the practice of idol worshippers to slaughter an animal over a pit and then eat a meal next to the pit. This is the basis for the Mishnah's next ruling. We may not slaughter an animal so that the blood flows directly into a hole under any circumstance, but one may make a hole in one's house and slaughter over the ground near the hole so that the blood enters the hole indirectly. However, one may not do even this in the street so that one does not lend support to the non-believers.